Hello, caller. Hello, caller. Welcome to the show. Welcome to Astrology Numerology Now. Hello. Is that Mr. Z Starman? Yes, it is. This is Z Starman. Hello. Good evening. Good evening. Who am I speaking with? You're speaking to Caroline from the Upper East Side. Hello, Caroline. How are you? Not doing too badly this evening. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you for coming and, and visiting Astrology Numerology Now. Thank you for having me. How can I help you tonight? Well, um, I'm interested in astrology and I wanted to just talk to you about it. Okay. Um, are you the gentleman who used to have a show on Tuesdays on Kiss, Kiss FM? Yes, that's me. I'm, oh, uh, wow. Yes, I'm that Z star man. I was on uh, the Kiss Wake Up Club with Jeff Fox, Shayla, and Talent. And every Tuesday morning, I did astrology and numerology readings. I am a pro professional astrologer. And that's what I did. You were a listener. I was a listener every Tuesday morning on my way to work on Sailingly. I, I thought your show was absolutely wonderful. Why, thank you very much. What day is your birthday? Um, I'm a bit old. December 18, 1965. December 18, 1965. That's the, correct. The name of this show is Astrology Numerology Now. You're born mm -hmm. on the 18th, so I'm going to start off with numbers with you, Caroline since you're a loyal listener and I got a fan who just called in. <laughs> uh, uh, you're born on the 18th, so all days that add up to the number nine are your positive days. Sagittarius is the ninth sign of the zodiac. Um, mm -hmm. And uh, you're born on the 18th, so the 18th, the 27th, and the 9th are your positive days. This has been a number four personal year, so you had a, it's been a kind of rough year for you, hasn't it been, I would imagine? Yeah. It has been for me, and I, I suppose quite a few others, yes. I have to be honest about that, yes. Okay. Now, I'm looking at your chart, and you're a Sagittarius, but your moon sign is Scorpio. You have a very powerful sex drive, don't you? Um, um, let me put it this way. I have been told that. <laughs> You have a very, well, that's the moon in Scorpio. Scorpios, birds uh, fly, fish swim, Scorpios love sex. And I bet you're uh, a very sexual and passionate person. I'm being respectful here. Um, I suppose one could say that. Okay. Now, I'm picking up, you know, one of the things about being an astrologer and numerologist you're a Scorpio, so you, you're very intense. Your moon sign, your moon sign controls your emotions and feelings, and you like to argue. You're an arguer. I, let, me, let me just take a guess. Are, do you work in anything in legal, or are you a lawyer or anything like that? Yeah, well, that's kind of freaky, actually, I have to confess. I do happen to be an attorney, actually. You're an attorney? Mm-hmm. Okay. Yes, I am. Yes, that's what I was picking up. You're a lawyer. You love to argue, uh, uh, and, and that's the way the, the Sagittarius part. I always say to Sagittarius people, uh, their motto is, I don't bite my tongue because it hurts. I say whatever's on my mind whenever. Okay. <laughs> that's just the way I am. <laughs> and, and, and that's the thing with, with your moon sign in Scorpio. You're very intense. I see, do you work in transportation or anything like that? Because Sagittarius is about moving, it's about moving fast and going long distance travel. I see a lot of cars around you for whatever reason. Oh, well, not to, to reveal too much. I do happen to work for the Gecko, otherwise known as Geico. Geico? Yeah. Well, that's um, cars, that's like car insurance, isn't it? Well, absolutely, that's exactly what we are. You knew about the Gecko, I'm sure you did. Yeah, you have the, the English accent like the Gecko. <laughs> How are you, Mayte? I'm not doing too badly, thank you very much. Okay. I, I'm ju I just can't believe I'm speaking to you. It's just like a, a surreal moment, really. Well, I'm glad to be speaking with you also. Um, next year, be prepared to make a lot of changes, Caroline. And, um, I like change. What kind of changes are we talking well, about? Well, changes, I, 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 I'm feeling something in your relationships. Uh, um, if you're involved with... Um, let's say, a Libra or an Aries person, beware. What sign is your significant other? Uh, a Libra? <laughs> <laughs> You're is, having a great night tonight. Now, I'm, what I, am I supposed to be 
beware of. Well, well, I mean, I, I feel that he has some emotional problems. Maybe he has some, um, maybe, you know, I'm keeping it real because that's what astrologers do. I feel that this man is in some kind of recovery mode from either drugs or alcohol or something like that. Oh, well, now you're putting all my business out there. <laughs> <laughs> I have to say, uh, one of my I'm, I'm good things, tonight. I'm I'm hitting it on the nose tonight. So that's what astrologers uh, do. Apparently, but no comment. But let's keep on going. <laughs> I'm a comic. <laughs> well, this uh, I'm the comic astrologer. All right. Well, one thing about Sagittarius and Libras, Sagittarius is a fire sign and Libra is an air sign, and he's a very sweet man. He's absolutely adorable. I think children like him a lot. And, you know, I think he's a children's advocate or something like that. He works... Well, he, he works in the teaching profession, so... Oh, okay. As usual, you're spot on again. Okay, well, he's a teacher and you're a lawyer, so there's never a boring moment around your household, Caroline. That would be an understatement of the century otherwise. Okay. <laughs> now, is there anything specifically I can help you with? I like this call. We're staying on this call a little bit longer, but this is Caroline from the Upper East Side. Uh, and, and is there anything else you'd like to know? Anything in the horizon with regards to my career? Okay, well, I, I see the changes. Maybe you're going to, you know, I, I see you getting your own practice. Oh, interesting. Have you been thinking about getting your own practice? Yeah, I want to do something a little bit more. I don't know. Yeah. Get my teeth into something, yeah. But that I sounds th interesting. But yeah. again, um, we have to go to another call, and I want to thank you for calling in, Caroline. And, uh, well, can I just ask, ask a very quick question? I, I can't help it. Sure. Um, if I had to contact you for a very detailed chart for myself and probably my, my significant other, and how do I get in contact with you? Okay, we're going to, um, I'm going to ask my producer, Didi Kelsey, to put the number up. Uh, you'll see the number on the screen. That number is 212-875-8757. 4889, Caroline. 875-4899? No, no, that's 212-875-4889. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. 4889. Eight, yes, you thank can, you so much. It's been wonderful speaking to you. Why, thank you very much, Maite, and God bless you, and you have a great evening. Well, you keep up the good work. Thank, thank you. you. Thank you very much. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. We just love callers like Caroline, and one thing, it's about feeding. You have to want to be read if you're, if you're getting a reader, if you're getting an astrology or numerology reading. You have to want to be read, and I just felt open and she was very open and honest. And, and Caroline, if you're still there, please call back anytime.